What's good, folks? Once again, it's your boy, Shalako, Sha Fitness underscore Tattoo Art on Instagram and CMDDOS on Twitter and also on PlayStation Network, bringing to you another dope video on some dope kicks. And of course, you know how we start. Baboosh. We start with the genie in the box, the genie in the box, the what, what, what? The genie in the box. So, we have to start off with this dope box, man. This box is crazy. As you can see, it's a Star Wars theme. Bam! Alright, let's take this out. Badoosh! Badoosh! So, of course, we got some Star Wars Adidas Ultra Boost. The paper is dope. Look at that paper. So crazy. All these details. I love all the bells and whistles. It makes it that much doper. You know what I'm saying? Box dope, paper dope. Yes, we know you can't wear the box or the paper, but hey, all those little details matter when you got a dope collab. So, Adidas Ultra Boost. S, what is it? S and L. S and L S W. That's what it says right there. S and L S W. S L L is the, is the silhouette style, but obviously we know it's an Ultra Boost sneaker. This is fresh, man. Just for you guys' information, there is a big sale on Ultra Boost. So go check it out at your local sneaker store on the website. But I would say it's probably cheaper in store. Um, yeah, very very cheap. Way, 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 way under retail, just FYI. Um, and these sneaks are very comfortable. So for them to be so uh, low under retail and you're getting bang for your buck as far as comfort goes, man, I'm telling you, just go try a pair on if you've never tried a pair on. But uh, let's show you what the, what the kicks is looking like. So there we go with the toes. Here we go to heels. The bottoms, medial, lateral sides, the tongue, and the insoles are pretty dope too. Hopefully you guys can see that. And I like how they switched up with the new style with this new sole right here, Continental. These are pretty dope better grip than the original pair um yeah these came out last december and they're on sale now <laughs> so i don't know if it was because ultra boost the ultra boost wave is dying or going down but this just the whole ultra boost everything i remember when these first came out like five six years ago the silhouette it was hard to get your hands on a pair man these things was flying like hot cakes now it's like the attention is off of these, which is good, because that means you can get them for cheap and they go on sale and all that other good stuff. So, like I said, if you never tried a pair on, head down to your local sneaker store and try a pair on. They are on sale right now. Um, yeah, man. Like, let me just talk, get you into the details now. So, it's the X-wing fighter from Star Wars. Uh, you know, got the little details of it right here on the sole, which is a nice touch. That's pretty dope, right here, and it goes up into the heel panel as well. The X-Wing Fighter. And on the back of this heel tab, it says stay on target. And on the back of this one, it says the force will be with you always. Super dope. This collab is so crazy, man. So this one has the Adidas and the Star Wars on the tongue. And this one has the X-Wing Fighter on the tongue. Yeah, this diagram right here for the X-Wing Fighter is so dope, man. Um, they did some other pairs as well. For Adidas models with different uh, Star Wars aircraft. And yeah, so this is a basic colorway gray, you know what I'm saying, with a little bit of orange hits just to bring it out, make it pop. It's another pair, you know what I'm saying, just throw on, get comfortable, whatever the case may be, not too crazy. Nice breathable mesh upper, you know, prime knit, all that. Mesh, breathable upper. You know, they call them the sock shoes, right? Because they, you know, there's no hard materials really. 
you know, got the cage, roll cage on the side with the three stripes to, you know, keep your foot in place. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. These, these are pretty basic, man. Like I said, I had a pair, bought my first pair like five years ago. Very, very comfortable. I wore them so much, man. I, I, I don't even wear them no more as much now because I've been trying to rotate my other sneakers. But, man, yeah, these are dope. And um, it has some lace Dubrays with some Star Wars insignia here on the Dubray on both and the laces themselves orange with more star wars logo stuff here on the tips orange tips it says boost on the inside of the tongue on both tongues it says boost like i said these are pretty dope I'll show you the insoles too real quick so you can see that x-wing fighter bang I'll show you the other one so you can see that one too so it's like, if you put them together, it's the whole aircraft. You can kind of see it there a little bit, but that's it right there. Pretty dope, man, pretty dope. I love all these little details. Um, so crazy that, like to me right now, seeing Boost on sale is just insane to me. We're gonna talk about that here in a little bit, but let me show you the other little addition I added to these, because on my other Ultra Boost, you know, like I said, these are sock sneakers, so you don't really have to put laces in them, really. You can just wear them without them, but um, because this thing hugs your foot. But I hit up my people in, in San Francisco Bay Area, my old Stomper Grounds, fully laced for the orange laces with the 3M in it to match these. So that's going to pop on these. So when I do my on foot, you'll see it on my Instagram. You know what I'm saying? That's going to pop very nice. So it's crazy because they both pretty much came in the mail at the same time. But yeah, that's gonna look dope inside these rope laces. Rope laces, put those in there, gonna look super fresh. You know, I like to switch it up, you know what I'm saying? Do a little something different on these. Um, but yeah, man, it's been crazy. Like I said, over the last five years, um, I feel like Ultra Boost, they was at a high point five years ago. So I'm talking about 2015, 2016 timeframe, 2017, that time frame. This thing was like hard to get a pair. They stayed, they held their price. You know, the you know, original price on these is 180 and when you could pay, when you get basically $120, $130 off, and they're just sitting on shelves, like all types of different styles, it's like, come on, man, you have to just grab a pair. And then you always have to think, like, what's happening with Ultra Boots from the drop so low? That's a crazy thing to me. I've never seen Ultra Boots on sale like this, you know? Um, and I don't know if it's just Adidas across the board, because I've seen a few other Adidas uh, brand like different type of models on sale as well but these been on sale man and I was just like I was in, I was just totally just taken aback by it so the question is is the ultra boost wave dead or dying I'm sure Adidas is still making their money because it's an international brand and they make money from they sock international and, they, and like overseas uh, Europe area Adidas is it man everybody Adidas track pants Adidas everything so um here in America, I probably feel like it's not the same like it is over there. They love Adidas over there, um, like I said, because of soccer um, or football. Um, and all, a lot of that stuff is, is, is through Adidas, and they wear a lot of Adidas over there. But um, here in America, I feel like it's not as much, not as prominent. Like, you won't see it as much here like you would see it over there. But, um, yeah, man, so, like I said, it's just up for debate. Let's, let's talk about it in the comment section. Do you think that Adidas Ultra Boost Wave has died? Yes, the Yeezy still sell and they have Ultra Boost in them, but I'm talking about these style, this type of Ultra Boost. You know what I'm saying? You know, I never really see Yeezys or the, or even the Pharrell uh, Human Races or anything like that sitting on shelves. But even though those last Pharrell Human Races that came out, they did sit from what I saw, the NMDs. Um, but seeing these on shelves and sitting and, and going on sale, I'm starting to think, like I said, that wave is heading down. But um, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. We can discuss it. But like I said, from what I'm seeing, I don't really, I, I feel like the wave has died down on these. Like the wave is coming down. You know, it's on a downward slope on these um, Ultra Boosts. Because like I said, I've never seen Ultra Boosts go on sale. Like not even $10 off. Much less seeing them $120, $130 off at the original price. So, you know, go figure. But I say these are good investment. If you just want a pair of sneakers to walk around in. Um, I personally don't recommend them for running for myself because I'm a runner um, and I have different type of sneakers I like to run in style wise and, and just uh, stability and all that but um, 
I, I did run in my other pair just to test them out, and they are soft and comfortable. But, um, yeah, not for me as far as running in this style of shoe. But, um, yeah, man, um, like I said, if you got any questions, comments, leave them in the comment section. Um, check out my, my folks, SF Bay Area Fully Lace. Go to their Instagram or their website. You can order you some laces. Um, so, like I said, it's Fully Laced SF. Or you can just type in Fully Laced, and it should pop up on your Google search. Um, that's pretty much it, y'all. I just wanted to bring y'all a quick video, a little review on these kicks, and that's pretty much it, man. Um, like I said, follow me on Instagram. Uh, it's SHA Fitness underscore Tattoo Art. And on uh, Twitter, it's CMDDOS and also on PlayStation Network in case you want to get a game in. And that's pretty much it, man. Peace.